On May the 28th, a huge landslide of mud, ice and debris wiped out the mountain village of Blatten in the Lerschental Valley down below. 10 million tonnes of rock from the crumbling Kleiner's nest horn behind me fell onto the Birch Glacier, which caused the glacier to collapse. The landslide dammed the small Lonza River nearby, creating a lake that submerged the few buildings that hadn't been buried under the debris. Over 95% of the village was destroyed. The 300 residents had been evacuated ahead of the disaster, but a 64-year-old man went missing. Swiss researchers say the country has warmed twice as fast as the global average. Higher temperatures are thawing permafrost that act as a sort of mountainside glue, raising the risks of landslides and rockfalls that can quickly turn deadly. In Switzerland, where 60% of the territory is mountains, the issue of thawing permafrost is being studied intensely. Before the, the Blatten event, uh, there were two major, uh, somewhere similar events with collapses of rock faces on a glacier, which triggered huge rock ice avalanche debris that went very far down in the valley. And this is a major concern for the very densely populated regions like uh, the European Alps. Today, the monitoring has been stepped up significantly and a no-go zone is in place. The mountain is still moving, 10 centimetres a day on some rock faces in summer, although it has slowed down with the arrival of winter. The mayor of Blatten hopes people can live in the rebuilt village in 2029. But some people say this is extremely optimistic. <laughs>